Hello there, my name is Mr. Smart Anki. Welcome to my last play of Roller Coaster Tycoon. So, if you are a lot younger than I am, then you probably have no idea what this game is. Or you may have heard of it but never played it yourself. Or you have played it because you're an absolute legend. That's very much possible as well. I'm just going to quickly jump into the first scenario just so I can talk about this massively loud music. I'm just going to pause the game immediately to quickly explain why I'm doing this, etc. Um, so, Roller Coaster Tycoon is. And Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 are probably two of the games I played the most in my childhood. I think the first one was released in, two, or in 1999 or something, which is when I was 8. Um, and I probably played it like later than 8, because I don't think I was really playing games yet when I was 8. But um, this is definitely one of the games that I played the most of uh, when I was younger. And uh, obviously I've been playing Planet Coaster lately. And Roller Coaster Tycoon World literally just went into early access today as well. Uh, by the time you're watching this, it'll have been a few days ago. Um, but that game is looking meh at the moment. I'm hearing a lot of bad things about it. So I was like, fuck it. Let's just play Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 again. So I'm not sure how far or how, how big I'm going to make this Let's Play. Because I don't know if I really want to like do every single scenario. Because as, as you can see like just now, if you have never played this game before, never seen it before... Um, it's like you've got scenarios, um, so you can sort of just go for as long as you want, but these scenarios have like a little goal that you have to achieve, and once you achieve that, then like I'll just end it there and then go on to the next scenario basically, and there's literally dozens upon dozens of these scenarios. Um, so anyway, the first one, Forest Frontiers. Deep in the forest, build a thriving theme park in a large cleared area, and our objective is to have at least 250 guests in our park at the end of October, year one, with a park rating of at least 600. So you can see the park rating right here. In the bottom right, you can see the date. It's currently March the 1st of year one. So we have until October um, the 1st of year one. So we've got, like, what is that, six months, seven months, whatever. Um, and, yeah, our goal is to uh, have 250 people and a park rating of 600, which is really easy to achieve. Like, we're going to make that in, a few, in like, two, two months or so, but we do have to keep going until October because we've got to make sure we keep that... Sorry, we keep those 250 people in our park, essentially. Um, so yeah, and then once we've done this one, I'll move on to the next scenario. And I'll just do them as long as I feel like, essentially. And then maybe I will do uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 as well. To be fair, the difference between them isn't too big, as far as I remember. There's, like, new coasters and stuff. Most people actually say that the first one um, it, with the expansions is better than just the second one, but just the sec or the second one with the expansions is better than the first one with the expansions. Um, I don't really remember personally, to be honest. I played a ton of both of them, um, but I just wanted to start with the first one, and then I'll probably hop on the second one as well. I never played the first one uh, back in the day that I didn't really play Roller Ghost Tycoon anymore at that point when the third one was released, um, and... I don't know, to me it looks not as good, just because I'm used to this art style, and they went for a completely different art style, the third one, like a really kiddie kind of art style. To be fair though, this is kind of kiddie as well. But anyway, without any further ado, I should probably just jump into it and show you guys my childhood game. So, first of all, I'm going to rename this park, because Forest Frontiers won't do. This is now Donkey Frontiers. Boom. And it'll change it once I unpause. There we go. Donkey Frontiers. Let's just put a uh, an admission price of 5 Euros immediately. Euros are already in the game, even though they didn't exist back then, so I must have punched them in or something. Um, I could have gone with dollars or whatever. There's actually, like, loads of... Actually, I think I can actually show you. Oh, that might actually not work. I don't really want to fuck it up, because the way I'm running this, you can probably see... Let's just pause it again for a second. You can see I'm playing... Actually, you know what? I'm pause it, because we're going to have plenty of time for this. Um, you can see that I'm playing on... Uh, what looks like 1910, uh, 1920 by 1080. It's not exactly that. It's slightly upscaled, but it's almost that. Um, uh, this game obviously naturally doesn't have those settings. It's like 600 by 800 and... What, actually, no, it's not 800 by 600 and like really small um, resolutions because it's such obviously such an old game. But I had to jump through a whole lot of loops and stuff and I managed to get it working at this resolution. Um, Fraps doesn't record it though, so I'm recording this with OBS, it's just, I mean, I have to go through a whole bunch of hoops, but it's finally working, um, in a good resolution, so, and the nice thing is this game, even though it doesn't support the resolutions, it doesn't look, uh, it doesn't do any st stretching or anything, it literally just uh, makes the screen bigger, as you can see, like, all these buttons up here, normally these take up your entire top bar, like, the, the screen goes to, like, right here, basically, that's the screen. But, um, because obviously with a, uh, a bigger screen, it sort of just, it, put, it keeps the buttons in the same place and it just adds like a whole bar of nothing to the right. But it, yeah, there's no stretching involved, so the game looks really good actually uh, in 1920 by 1080. 
But anyway, it's time to build some rides. Let's start with a, uh, a merry-go-round. Actually, I want to remove some trees as well. Let's do that real quick because they are just going to be in the way if I leave them around. So I'll have to get used to like how the controls work and stuff because it's very old school. Like WASD doesn't actually move the camera. So I have to either press the right mouse button and do that or I have to use the arrow keys. Um, also, like to just like look around like this. I have to actually hold on. There's another tree in the corner there. I saw that. Get the fuck out of here, tree. You don't belong here. Um, yeah, you have to actually press the button. I'm sure there's hotkeys and stuff as well, but I don't actually know because I never really used them and I couldn't be bothered to look them up right now. So, anyway, let's start building our uh, our park. So let's go for a Mari go around right here. Let's uh, put our entrance and exit down, and we're gonna put a path down. Let's do it like this. I'm gonna put it like right there. And then an exit puff, and boom, open that bad boy up. And we're gonna ask 50 cents for people to get in there. I wanna change the colors a little bit here. Actually, you know what, I gotta open the park up as well. Get the puff out of here, open that park up. Donkey Frontiers now open for business. We've got one merry-go-round. whoop de fucking do All right, I'm gonna go for like an orange theme, and then... I like that. That looks pretty, pretty nifty right there. Sweet, so we got Merry Go Round 1. We can actually change the names of these rides as well. Um, but I don't really know what to call them, so for now I'll just leave them the way it is. Oh, there's our first customer right there, guest number 3. Oh, there's actually an option to change them to having actual names, but I guess going with guests is fine. Uh, anyway, let's build something else. Let us build this... This, this slide right here, the spiral slide, this is, oh, this is thrilling right here. The thrilling rides, absolutely crazy stuff. Okay, and let's open it up right away. We'll build the puff in a second, I'm sure it'll tell us. You haven't got a puff yet, you need to get your puff. There's no exit. There we go, I did it before it said. Alright, I'm gonna ask the 50 cents for this as well. Some good stuff. Alright, let's move on. Oh, I want to change the colors on this thing too. I'm going to stick to a nice orange theme, because orange is my favorite color. Oh, actually, hold on. I might be able to pick this orange as well. Yeah, that looks nifty as fuck. Alright, slide number one is in business. Let us build something else. Hold on, what's the thoughts of these people so far? I want to go on something more thrilling than slide one. Well, guest number three, have I got the thing for you, the haunted house. This is as thrilling as you can get, sir. Just you wait. All right, let's build a path. Let's go stick to this blue path for now. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. And then, oh shit, let's do it like, there we go. That. All right, haunted house one, you are open for business. And we're gonna charge 50 cents for that as well. I'm sure I'll up the price at some point. You know what? I think our, our park is good enough to charge 10 euros now. People are still going in? Yeah, people are still going in. All right, perfect. Okay, all joking aside though, we need something more thrilling. So why don't we build a roller coaster? A steel mini roller coaster. These things don't go very high, but it's pretty cheap to build this. So let's build a custom design, because we don't do Designs that are already pre-built. Fuck that. All right, let's start. Actually, that's a good space. All right, let's go make a massive roller coaster. I want to have a good line so we can have enough. You know, one more is fine. So we can have enough um, um, cars, like trains. All right, let's go up as far as possible. There we go. That's not very high, but that's the thing. This that's the thing with this roller coaster. All right. Let's just go immediately down like an absolute madman, and then we go for a super cool turn like that. And then let's uh, equalize and then go straight back up. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. And then we don't want to go too far. Actually, we need one more turn though. I don't know if that's going to work. Is that the same height? Yeah, so if it's the same height, we're not going to actually be able to get back up again. So we gotta make sure we don't do that. Let's, uh, let's do a small turn then. That works. Yes, that, that we, should, we should be able to make that, I think. Alright, let's go down like crazy again. I'm just gonna make another turn like that. Actually, you know what? Let's... Um, uh, let's turn... This way. Are just, yeah, those are just in the way. Get the fuck out of here, trees. You think you're... You're in my park now. Okay. Let's go straight for a bit. 
And then we'll do a uh, S bend left. Alright, and then we'll um, go back up again. Can I actually go up one and then like this? Can I fit that there? No, that's not going to work at all, actually. Alright, I'll go a small turn. And then we go straight through there. Am I on the same... Yeah, I'm on the same level as one of those other things. Hold on. I want to do something really cool here. It's like go straight through the, the ride, essentially, again. Shit, I have to go up, I think, if, I, if anything. Let's turn this around real quick, because I can't see anything over there. Uh, no, I think we just got too much shit over there. That doesn't really work anymore. Okay, you know what? Let's, yeah, let's go wider. No, that doesn't work either. Alright, let's just go straight. Yeah, let's do that. Straight is way cooler. There we go. That'll work. I'm not sure if we can actually reach back up here again, but we'll find out. We're now on the same level as we were, so I can't even... Oh, I can still turn. Okay. Um, hold on. Let's see if I... Yeah, I do run into it. Okay. So I can't do a large turn then. No, I can do a small one. Okay. Um, let's go down and then turn like that again. And then turn like that. I have no idea if we're going to actually be able to make it, like, up to this level every time. I feel like that's not going to be possible, actually, this, like, right here. Maybe I should actually... Yeah, let's head back real quick. Um, well, that's what I did. So let's do a small turn here, then. Does that work? No, that doesn't work. Hold on. Alright, we just gotta... I'm gonna go like this then, and then a small turn. Is that what I just... Yeah, that works. Fi 15? Yeah, 15 should be alright. Okay, and then I went to the right, and then... Uh, I went down, didn't I? And then turn. Oh, this is gonna be bad. The fucking ass! Okay. Um... Do like a really long turn, I guess. Actually, you know what? We can do a bank turn. Like that. Oh, that's the wrong way. <laughs> like that. Yeah! I love bank turns. Alright, let's go up a little bit. Uh, yeah, we have some speed here. We can do that. We can maybe I'll do that. Maybe. Eh, let's not go too crazy. Let's just go up twice like that. Yeah, that should be doable. Turn like that. Turn back. Actually, you know what? We should do, um... Just go down, and then like that. Oh, I gotta... Actually, oh, that tree's in the way. Get that fuck out of here, tree. You think you're cool and all that? Okay, this is... I mean, this is actually, um... I don't mean this is very safe at all, actually, but we're gonna do it anyway. Let's do, um... A little up... Just uh, keep the thrill going, you know. Okay, can we do a... I think mean, we don't have enough room for this anymore, do we? Maybe, but I don't think we can actually get out of there anymore then. Oh yeah, we can. Heck yeah. Okay, and yeah, that's... nope, one more. Boom! Alright, this is... what a ride. I can't wait to see this bad boy in action. All right, let's test this out real quick. Please make it. I'd be pretty upset if we can't make it at some point and we have to redo that entire thing, because that... I don't know, this last bit looks kind of shit, but... Maybe I'll do something cool and actually have, like, a path go over here and then we have some ride here. That'd be cool. Yeah, that's actually a pretty nice idea. But first, we gotta just make sure we make it up there. Every single time. We can keep the test results up as well. There we go. Alright, I feel like with the first one, we should be alright to make it back up. Oh, it's starting to become shitty weather. Yeah, we'll make that one. This one I'm a little more worried about. Oh, that is not going very fast, but is it fast enough? It is fast enough indeed. And then we go full on down again, and then we should be alright. I'd say. It's not going very fast through those corners, to be honest, but... Yeah, that's alright. It's a decent first roller coaster, right? I mean... It's kind of slow going through these turns here. It's like a bank turn and you go super slow. It's not very really thrilling, but... I'm sure it's a great ride and everyone will want to go on here anyway. Alright, what have we got? 
excitement rating low, intensity rating extreme, nausea rating very high. Okay, that sounds pretty decent. Let's open it up for biz business. Gotta make a ride or a, a road to it. That can just go there. Okay, let's do a bit of this. And then. Uh, oh, that doesn't work actually. Gotta. Come into the spa real quick. Sorry, kid. Uh, I'm gonna move this path as well, actually. And then that one, just to sure it's right there. All right, perfect. Let's fix this back up again. All right, open for business. Roller coaster one. Oh Jesus! Been neglecting all this stuff. Let's up the price here a little bit. Eighty cents. This one too. Jesus, that is popular as fuck. People love this merry-go-round. Okay, I need to hire some people. Me to do that. Let's get a handyman in here. Now I used to always just turn off mowing grass and then set up like a paw for these people. Um, I guess you deal with all this stuff. Like the beginning bit basically. Oh, got a ferris wheel available. Heck yeah. Okay, let's get a mechanic. Let's get a security guard. We should be able to do with like one of each right now. And an entertainer. Do some entertaining. Sorry, bud. Let me, uh... Oh, you're already on the path. Sorry. I don't want a stupid panda. We want an elephant. Boom. Alright, let's get rid of all this. What can you... Can I tell you to do anything else? No, you're just entertaining. What about security guard? No, you just secure us. Okay, cool. Um... Are people going in the roll man, people are just like coming out of the haunted house going straight back in again. Oh, that kid is like definitely too scared. What well, the one looks too intense for me. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty intense, bud. It's nothing it's enough for you. Alright, uh is this set to wait for a full load? Let's wait for um half load. Jesus, is this like yeah, this is way too intense for all these stupid kids. Oh, some of them are going in. Look at them, they're like jumping like shit man. I wanna go in there. Um, let's see. Is there anything else? Actually, I want to change the color scheme. Not that that really changed the excitement level or anything, but... And that color... Ooh, that looks horrendously disgusting. Let's not do that. What about the other way around? That's better, but still pretty crap, but we'll, we'll keep it. And then... We will do this... White. That looks alright. All in the same colors. What about white? Yeah, actually that's not white. That one, there you go, that looks better. Okay, we can also do this. Oh, that looks pretty sweet actually. But we'll stick to normal for now, because I'm sure I'll go like through all of the um, things anyway. Right, we need to get some money, so we need to open up some shops here. Alright, a burger bar. Um, yeah, let's just put everything right here, I suppose. There's a burger bar. Open that up. Same pro for the pri uh, throughout the park even. Open up a uh, drink right next to it. Open that up. Same price throughout the park. And a popcorn thing right there as well. Open that up. Same price throughout the park. And some toilets around the opposite side. Boom. And that will be free. Yes. Okay. I'll start making us some money. We're down to three hundred or three thousand three hundred and twelve bucks right now. Yeah, this um, this roller coaster it looks like it's a little too intense for most people. <laughs> well, once we get more people in the park, I'm sure there will be more people. Who will be like, oh, we're not fucking afraid. I'll go in there. Is there a way to like tune it down, like make it go slower or something? <laughs> Extreme. Um. 72 customers per hour. I don't think I think that's lying. We've had total two customers. Yeah, that's not exactly right. Looks too intense. Looks good value. Oh right, but I'm like asking any money. Well, this thing can definitely get like two bucks or something. Yeah, everyone's saying really good value, even though they're not going in, going in it. Ah, uh, there's a few kids coming now. I think we're waiting for half load, but it's definitely not a half load. Let's just set it to full load. Or any load. Yeah, let's, let's keep any load for now, actually. Alright, let's make some more shitty rides that people will actually go into and pay me for. Let's, um... I wanna... We unlocked something, right? Yeah, the Ferris wheel. I wanna put the Ferris wheel in here. 
Actually, we can do it like this. Oh. Commenting that your park entrance is very cheap. Perhaps you could increase the fee to make more money. That would probably be a good idea. Uh, entrance right here. Exit right there. Let's put that price up immediately. Let's go up to a whopping 15. No, let's go 20. Fuck it. People will still go in, I'm sure. We have a really awesome park, so... Alright, let's uh, make a path here. Let's turn this camera around real quick so I can actually see what's going on. Um, okay, we'll do uh, we'll do this. That should be good enough. Right, and then we need to go up. Oh, shit, that's not the way it works. Right, let's delete that. I'll go... Hold on. There you go. I'm not sure if we actually have enough room to go up here. I uh, sure we need to go up one higher. There you go, perfect. Uh, actually, we need to go further that way, so I'm not sure how this is going to work, actually. This is going to look very disgusting. Let's, um, let's hold off for a second, because I'm going to place another thing down here as well, which is the... this thing. The swinging ship. So we'll place that. Right. Oh, nope. Damn it. Uh, can I... Damn it. No, I didn't want to delete it. I don't know how much money that just that it cost me right there, but um, right there. Oh, I got all the money back. All right, cool. All right, let's put this right there and there, and then we put a path. Let's see how did I? I got it. That one like that's. Damn it! I can't see anything. Still can't see anything. There we go. Um. I guess we'll do this like this then. Eh. Fine. Make it a little shorter, I suppose. Alright. And then we'll just do this. And then we'll jump over from here. Oh. Right. Up. Oh shit, I just pressed the wrong button. Up. Up. And then straight. And let's go straight over there. And down. Boom! Nailed it! Open that up. 50 cents. Uh, yeah, for now that's alright. And open this bad boy up. And 50 cents. Oh. Alright! This park's starting to become awesome! It's too bad our, um, our roller coaster is too fucking scary. I <laughs> maybe shouldn't have made that scary. It doesn't really seem that scary though. I definitely made scarier, scarier ones before. Uh, Anyway, let's turn this camera around. There we go. It's a little better. I've definitely made scarier roller coasters in the past, I believe, but... Okay, so we are in May the 12th right now. What are you saying about this place? Let me, uh, give me your thoughts. Am I going on roller coaster one while it's raining? I need to get a kiosk. Oh my god, this thing is so fucking popular. Let's ask for more money. 120. This thing as well. Jesus. 120 there, too. This thing is now 50. Let's ask for 80 cents. We'll get, like, if people say it's too expensive or something, it's fine. Okay, don't want to go on the road while it's raining, while it's raining, while it's raining. Not hungry. Well, that's fine. Just don't buy anything then. The music is nice here. It's too crowded here. Who are you, you little shit? Oh, fucking hell, he's excited though. People are crazy. How much money did you bring? A lot of money, nice. He's already spent 12 bucks and 10 cents. He's living off of this kid alone. All right, let's um, get another uh, handyman in here somewhere. All right, sir. You are gonna not do mowing the grass, and you're gonna set your path to... There, oh. Something like that. Yeah, seems fair. So most of that has nothing right now, so. All right. Let's make some more stuff. How much money have we got? 3.8. 3.7 even. We got 225. There you go. We, are, we already nearly have our 250 guests. And our park rating is 667 already. So we are... Oh, somebody just broke down. The uh, Ferris wheel did. There you go. Merry-go-round. Oh, sorry. Not Ferris wheel. The merry-go-round. Where's our uh, mechanic? Heading for merry-go-round. Where is he right now, though? miles away. 
There he is. Okay, hold on. Let me help you out. Uh, I think he goes in for the back, actually. So let's put him in there. Oh, put him there. There you go. Oh, wait, but he's just... Does he go in? What's he doing? Yo, bud. Yo. We need someone here. Okay, let's hire another guy. Let's put him right there. Answering radio call. There you go. Okay. Um, we should make some more shit. Let's, uh, let's build this scrambled X thing right now. Let's, uh, let's put that right here. Uh, hold on. I want to put it right there. Yeah, it's alright. Exit and entrance. Open that bad boy up. Ask for a buck for now. That's alright. Oh. One euro, please. Um... Let me just ride a little longer, or just line a little longer. Let's do this. Because we noticed there, um, those other lines are actually pretty filled up constantly. Haunted House currently not, but the uh, merry-go-round is pretty damn filled up. Go away. Alright, I want to keep this list of like people's thoughts on right now. I want to go on something more thrilling than Ferris Wheel 1. Well, wow. Scramble has no puff and leading to its exit. Oh shit, my bad. Got you. There you go. Um, not hungry. Slide one is not s thrilling enough. Okay, so these things are not thrilling enough. But then there's this fucking ride, which is absolute badass, and it's too thrilling for these people, apparently. Alright. Um, I need some trash cans and stuff. Just some random generic things that I should just place throughout the, the park. Let's place some, uh... Run trash cans everywhere and some. Uh, I don't care about lights. Some benches. You wanna sit, you know? Lazy as fuck, these people. I'm not gonna go like full on just placing everything properly and blah blah blah. I don't really care enough about that. Not in like scenario based stuff where we're gonna be moving on to a different one level at some point. Anyway, I think that's a good stopping point. We made. Um, Pretty awesome park. We've already surpassed what we have to do, but like I said, we have to keep going until uh, it actually is October. So I'm gonna leave it right there. So thank you all very much for watching the first episode of Rollercoaster Tycoon in the first scenario, Donkey Frontiers. I know it's called Forest Frontiers, but whatever. Anyway, um, until next time, thank you for watching. Have a good day and goodbye.